What's up, everybody? Justin here, bringing you another poorly reviewed beer. Happy May. We're starting off the month with a bit of a heavy hitter from Sierra Nevada Brewing Company in Chico, California, and Mills River, North Carolina. This is the 2017 edition of Optimum Triple IPA. Uh, here's what the folks at Sierra Nevada have to say. Optimum is a hurricane of whole cone hop flavor. Hopped, dry hopped, and torpedoed for incredible hop flavor and complexity, Optimum is the pinnacle of whole cone hoppiness and the biggest imperial IPA we have ever produced. It features resinous hop varieties, Magnum, Chinook, Simcoe, and a new exper experimental hop variety exclusive to Sierra Nevada. With intense hop flavors and aromas of grapefruit rind, pine, herbs, and tropical fruit, Optimum is an aggressive drinking experience. Originally created as part of our beer camp program, Optimum throws down the gauntlet to all other IPAs. 9.6% ABV, 65 IBU. Let's check it out. Okay. So, nice and crystal clear, pretty uh, gold goldish color uh, kind of reminds me of apple juice a little bit too and as I hold up the light I get uh, some some more yellow highlights but still a nice uh, gold color in the core of the glass uh, as you can see about probably a finger and a half yeah call finger and a half to two fingers worth of head uh, I can see a fair amount of bubbles shooting up through the through the beer up to the top but um, nice and pretty. Uh, pretty much crystal clear as well. No trouble seeing the uh, stuff on the glass through it. And no trouble seeing my fingers. Alright, let's get to it. Mm. Ooh. Certainly a whole bunch of citrus leading off. And uh, a mild amount of bitterness kind of towards the back end. Uh, kind of dive in for another shot. <clears throat> yeah, so I'm getting the, the citrus in a number of ways. Not just the, uh, the grapefruit rind I mentioned, but I feel like... Uh, Maybe some other, some other, um, like some actual, actual citrus, uh, flesh, if you will. I think the rind is also combining with the, the herbal note, which I think are kind of the, the two most notable items in this beer, most notable flavors, um, in the flavor profile, the, the citrus overall and the herbal. Some pine in there as well. I'm not really getting the the tropical fruit. Well, maybe I am. <laughs> There's a, a bit of a, a sweetness to it that I thought was more uh, boozy at first, but I could see how that's maybe uh, something like a, a mango or a papaya, something like that. Um, yeah, I definitely could, definitely could see that being uh, some mango notes. The, the bitterness is certainly building uh, as I drink more of it. Fairly heavy body to me for um, for this beer. And um, yeah, certainly bold flavors overall. As I said, I feel like it leads with, uh, I think the herbal is kind of the first thing followed by the the citrus notes and then i think the the um the tropical notes again i'm specifically picking up mango i feel like um that's kind of a, a third the pines maybe i feel like the, the pines in there and the the resiny hops are, are in there but they're just uh they're overtaken by a, a lot of as they say aggressive flavors a lot of a lot of powerful a lot of bold flavors going on in this triple ipa uh, quite tasty. I think one's probably probably would be the limit given the 
the high alcohol level and along with just how how intense it is. Yeah, big, big, bold flavors. And um, it really just comes up and slaps you in the face. But um, a really excellent triple IPA by Sierra Nevada. So that's it for this edition of Poorly Reviewed Beer. You can find all of my reviews, both video and written, along with news, commentary, and more at poorlyreviewedbeer.com. Also check out PRB on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Untapped. You'll find those links and usernames in the description below. If you're so inclined, please like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around at Poorly Reviewed Beer.